guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel, The Butterfly Effect, and today we're doing something very exciting. Mm. <laughs> oh, first off, Merry Christmas to whoever celebrates, and uh, Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever else there and is. And everything else. I hope your Christmas and your holidays was as great as ours. Yes. So we have some very, very exciting news. <laughs> I'm so excited, but I can't. I can like cry. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I'm too hype right now. I'm too hype. I'm too hype. So, <clears throat> we... Okay, let's tell them the background story so they so know. So it started how many nights ago? <laughs> like... A week ago, maybe? About a week ago. About a week ago. A week ago. Okay, um, about like six days ago, I don't even know how we got to the topic of like my birthday, because my birthday's coming up in May. I'm gonna be 20 fucking one. Yay! 21. Um, I think I just didn't break the table. Um, so we were just like, you know, talking, blah, blah, blah. I don't know how we got into the topic of vacationing, I think you asked me like what I wanted to do for my birthday. Oh yeah, I asked like, you like what you wanted to do and then like, got into like a weird like thing. Really, really weird. So we were like talking, blah, blah, blah. So we are like picking, picking the vacationing spots, right? Not thinking anything was happening or, or going to happen for yeah. that matter. Um, but yeah, we are going to fucking Turks and Caicos <laughs> in June. I am so excited. Like we, oh my God, like this, it all happened within three nights. Keep this in mind, like the actual like physical planning all happened within three nights. So yeah, but like we were talking like for about like a year, like that she wanted to do something for her birthday, but like now that's getting closer, it's like, wait, what are we actually doing? So like, like I have to fucking do something. So we're going to Tristan Caicos. We're going on a fucking island vacation. And I feel like we're the only ones who would like actually will do this by ourselves. Yeah. Like, like we're paying for our, mostly everything by ourselves, whatever. It's crazy, bro. Like, and when you can afford a trip, it's like your world is just like five times better because it's like, holy shit, like I paid for this. I paid to enjoy myself. I paid to have fun. So it's like a whole thing. So right now we're like going to be doing some phone calls and making some stuff happen. We sound like businesswoman out here. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> we're just going to be like, you know, checking some stuff out, making sure that everything is correct. And then before we do the major purchases that we need to do. Um, we're going to fucking Turks and Caicos. Like, this is insane. Like, I never thought the words, I'm going to Turks and Caicos, will come out of my mouth. Yep. Like, I felt that. No 21 year old and 18 year old that I know is going on their dime to a fucking island vacation. I know. Unless I'm you're like, Tana and like, can't afford to go. Like, whatever, but like, this is insane that we're like actually fucking going. Bro, I'm so excited. Like, I have, okay, I've been to the Caribbean before. So, I've never been. I know everything. I've been there since I was like not even born. So, I know like everything basically, but like, Turks and Caicos is like different. Everywhere's different, obviously, but like, oh, it's just gonna smell different. The air's gonna be different. And the like, water is going to be different. Like, everything, I I'm just like ready for it. I'm just ready. I'm like ready. I'm so excited. Like, like, we need this. Like, I need a fucking vacation. Mm -hmm. After the year I had. After my first semester is done, I'm just going to be so excited to just get the fuck away and go on vacation. It's going to come and go so quickly. I know. Like, I was really thinking, like, it's already almost the new year. And then it's going to be February. And then it's going to be your birthday. And then, boom, we're at June. And we're going to be like, fuck. <laughs> and we're going on a fucking plane. So once Easter hits, that's when it's gonna be like, oh shit, it's speeding up. We gotta yeah. go, we gotta go. Yeah. Oh I mean like up until like April it's gonna be like mm -hmm. Yeah. Like I just want you to be here and then all right, June tea, let's go on a plane, waking up at five six o'clock in the morning. We're gonna be waking up so much earlier. Alright, like two or three. Yeah, two or three o'clock. And she's gonna like sleep over the night before because we gotta we gotta blast. Um <laughs> we'll be taking a private <laughs> jet. <laughs> All right, calm down. I'm not gonna feel like Jeffree Star. We're gonna have to like obviously get like a ride to the airport, and then we're gonna have to like try to get through the airport, which we don't know how to do. But my mom says just read the signs. But you know, signs nowadays mean a lot of different things. So <laughs> we don't really know. Um... <laughs> but yeah, this is gonna be like a series of like up until we go. Yeah. We're gonna show you what we packed, probably. 
but those will be in more videos to come. Today we're just doing the basic, the basic like okay, yeah, and like doing what we gotta do. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, and I'm gonna fucking call United. And so, I'm gonna call this hotel. <laughs> let's get United on the phone. Um. You OPN, we should be closer to friends. If you OPN, engaging is on my agenda. Request my chariot, get ya. The doors OPN, take that hot road and hop in. Monarch butterflies, you should open up. I'm trying to put your heart together, found it broken up. Going up smoke, smoking up. Make sure the children in the house, she's inappropriate. The way she's approaching us, I disassociate. Exfoliate. Oh, okay. I'm going to assume that the number on the Expedia website is for the hotel and not for Expedia. It should be a... Open up. Tell you the number that's on there. <clears throat> Physically call the place. Okay. I was trying to find it, but they didn't have a number. Okay. Can we use your phone to call? Yeah. Um, so what am I asking? Just to make sure that, like... The prices are, I was gonna call you. Just to see if the price for the room is that price. Oh no, we gotta see what price the room is. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Hello, um, I was looking to book a room for like June 1st. Open up, you OPN, bitch you won't be BBM, we should be close to friends, if you OPN, engaging is on my agenda, request my chariot, get ya, the door's OPN, take that I wrote in her bed, I can't, no, I can't. All she has is the date. Okay, um, how much is the courtyard with the two double beds? The courtyard is $180 to make plus 20%. So it's $180 per night? $180 to make plus tax. Okay. All right, so roughly around like 190 ish it's gonna be roughly around like 190 because I think that's the price that we saw online. It's 190 plus that's correct. I'll tell you how much it is. Okay, okay. It'd be like $232 a night. $232 a night? $232 a night. Alright. Okay. Alrighty, thank you very much, ma'am. You're welcome. You're welcome. Right. Mm -hmm. $232 a night? How did that go up? Didn't she say 180? Did, did we not hear that right? We, Plus tax. I, I said 180, and then you said 190, and she's like, yeah, 190, and then she went to 232. She, okay, hold on. Let me use her, okay, wait, give me the fucking calculator. Hold on. 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 She said 20% tax. So, would it be plus? Oh, plus 0.20. 180 plus 0.20. Oh, wait, we multiply. It did multiplication. 36. So, $36 out of 120.
216. How is the price keep going on? Okay, we're just gonna... Oh, it's okay, it's okay. We're, oh we're just gonna use this website. Okay. And then just go with it, you know what I mean? I feel like this is more accurate. Maybe if you book it through the actual website, it's more. But if you book it through Expedia, it's less. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Just to okay. Because that's... <laughs> bitch, we cannot be adults. Okay. It's not that we can't be it adults. It was very confusing. There's the way she, prices. The way she said that, she said 180 And then I said 190 because that's what it said on the website. Like, her actual fucking website. Mm -hmm. And then she said 232. Bitch, two, which number is it? 232 times 7. Oh, my God. Let's see how much we have to pay. 1624 and then divide that by two 812 so it goes up by like almost like 200 see that math right there though guys you always gotta fact check your shit all right so we're just gonna buy through the website because i feel like that's safer because it does because now it's at 181 so we would be paying this yeah but that's the thing that we have she said that. I'm so okay. We're just gonna buy through this. That's easier, right? Okay. Guys, this is. Did this change? Okay. I love how you put. <laughs> I was very confused, bro. What's on the back? Um, you really broke the distance of how long you're gonna travel? Yes. <laughs> I think very good notes. All right, so what are we, okay. So the airplane ticket is good. Yeah, so that's $60 like you said. I feel like it's safe if we just do it on the website because I feel like if we pay for it, 181, it's not gonna change at checkout. You know what I mean? That is true. So. And if it does, we get our refund. I mean, I don't think there's a refund actually. There's only six rooms left. Still, let me refresh the page. I don't want to do it, but let's see what happens. The when she said the the apartment, I was like, oh wait a minute, I might pay that money. <laughs> All inclusive. Yeah. All inclusive. They have a fucking beach house. Why did we do that? Oh my god, we should have done reality house number like three. Like, bro. Are you gonna, are you gonna fucking load? She sounded like sort of bitchy too. Because I think she was confused on what we were asking. And we're Americans, so she was like, what is their accent? You know. Okay, 181 still for the first one. Okay. But how do we, cause when I, I think I went through the whole process, but there was no like selection of like what bed you want. Um, which I'm hinting. So. Okay, well, we're gonna have to figure it out. I think it's safe that we just buy it online because it is 181 still. Okay, so what are we gonna end up buying first? The plane ticket? Yeah. Okay, which would be 454 50. Oh, so I did have the right numbers for the room. Because I was doing it off the. Oh, which one? I keep on getting fucking coffee on my paper. Now we're gonna have to do it. Just do, use some white out. No, I can't. <laughs> I wish I could like turn my phone off and like never use it. Mm -hmm. Do you ever have those days? Yeah. Because I'm at that point right now. I'm not even full of talking afternoon. I feel good. I'm so excited. Like I just want you guys to get here. Already. Um, but yeah. So like we said, this is gonna be like a series, I guess you would call it. Um, you know. I'm, I cannot wait to like vlog in the um airport. I'm so, I'm so excited. But when we do, we're just gonna like probably film in the Uber in the morning. Um, I want I want to try to like talk to people. Like, if you guys know me, you guys know I'm like what's the word extroverted? Intro. I don't talk to people. Extroverted? I'm an extroverted person. So I don't really like talk to people unless I really know them. So I'm like sort of shy. But like, I want to talk to people, you know, on vacation. I want to talk to the locals. I'm introverted, for sure. Yeah, I want to talk to the bartender. I want to talk to my Uber driver. I want to get the bartender's number, but you know. 
I want to like talk to people. Like, this is like a once in a lifetime trip that we're doing. Like, why not just go all out? Like, if I oh, if I embarrass man, myself, I if I embarrass myself, they're not gonna know me. You know, they're all the way in another country. They will literally never see us again. I know, unless we become famous on YouTube, then like maybe they will know us. But like, they won't know me. Like, it's fine. Like, I can embarrass myself all I want. So, I'm gonna like try talking to people. But in the Uber though, it's gonna be like early AM. So I don't know how you guys are gonna see me, but you guys want to see her. <laughs> be dark as fuck. We're gonna have to ask if I'm late. <laughs> I'm so fucked up to myself. <laughs> You're horrible. Wow. It's true though. But I'm so excited. I'm so ready. Oh, and also we have some awesome footage coming for the um vacation as well. I'm because so excited. She got a GoPro for Christmas. GoPro Hero 8. And yeah, so it's gonna be fun. I got all the gear. I got like, I'm playing around with it to make sure I know how to use it. So, it's gonna be dope, guys. It's gonna be dope. Like, so mm. it may seem like. I'm yeah, she's just copying everything down again. Because I got coffee on my paper. So. What I'm scared about is that our, our, our flight's gonna get like delayed. I'm hoping it doesn't. But here's the thing, we have time before check-in is. If that's the case. Technically, if we buy the hotel, they can't give the room away because we're gonna be there. I think it's check-in after three. And I think that's what it is. <laughs> I have a little notebook, it's so cute. Um. Check-in starts at 3 p.m. So it starts at 3. So you could come like 4. Yeah. So God forbid that happens. Let's just hope that it doesn't. Yeah. Then. Because um, worst comes worse, we're not going to. We're supposed to land at like 12.55. So we're not going to. Let's say it got delayed like a few hours. More like an hour. We wouldn't get there until like 1.55. That's not too bad. See, like, I don't think we'll have difficulty getting on the plane. Mm -hmm. It's the fact of us landing in Turks and Caicos is the problem. Because we don't know our way around the airport, no. the land, we don't know shit. Worst comes to worst, we could just ask somebody for help. Communication's which... key. I feel like everyone's going to put down their phone and actually talk. So I feel like, you know, phones aren't helping no one. You know what I mean? I'm not going to be on my phone until we get through security and TSA. Because yeah, I don't feel safe not looking up. I literally am going to be scared shitless going through the airport. I've never flown by myself. I don't think she's flown by herself either. No, I heard So this is like a new thing for both of us. So we're going in it heads on. <laughs> like we will not. Like we're not messing around. And like obviously the Caribbean islands, if you guys know, like there's a lot of stuff going on. And like it's not exactly the safest place. Like nowhere safe. But like. A lot of stuff happens. At this moment, it's not. Yeah, so. so we are obviously going to be very safe about it. And um, we have we, ha we have a little code. <laughs> we, have a little, we have a few rules that we're going to follow when we're there because for our safety. Um, we're like not leaving each other's side. Like I'm not hooking up with anybody. Yeah, this, we're not On leaving. this vacation, like we're staying as close as we can to the hotel. Yeah. Leaving when necessary, uh, unless we really need to, yeah. like going to a hospital or something. Yeah. Like that's where this something happens. Yeah, I did look it up. It's not that far from the hotel. I looked it up too. I looked up all of it. <laughs> because knowing my luck, I'm gonna get alcohol poisoning. Yeah, and like we need to know like everywhere, and um, <clears throat> we're gonna have obviously trackers and all that. So. Yeah, like I already have my location on for my parents. I don't. Well, they don't have iPhones. So. Well, I'm not ashamed of having it. But like, obviously your brother does, so. Yeah, I guess gonna end up getting mine. I told him to add me on Snapchat, so that way he has it, just in case my like message stops working in another country. But, this is gonna be interesting. If you guys have any um, traveling trips, let us know. Because like, I'm open to new ideas, like any like, um, if you all have ever been to Turks and Caicos, let us know. Tell us if it's good around town, like where to go, mm -hmm. um, you know, just some like fun things to do. Because like, obviously we want to have a good time. Oh like, yeah, we want to have a good time. <laughs> so right. bars are very crucial on this vacation. Yeah. And yeah, let us know what your ideas for that. Mm -hmm. um, super excited. Like, 
I'm ecstatic. Like, I might not seem like it. But like, we're, like, we just like don't want to hype it up, you know what I mean? And too much. And then like our hearts be like, exactly. shattered. But like, we have no reason to really leave the hotel. Like, we have everything. All we need to do is for like the first day, get groceries. We only need like a little bit because we're only staying for a few nights. Yeah. And plus we're going to be eating out anyway. Yeah. The food looks amazing. The, we're right on the, like, we could go swimming anytime we want. Like, we got the pool, we got the beach, we got AC. <laughs> we got everything that we want right there. Wi-Fi. So, we're going to be doing some work. I just really hope there's, like, a bar inside of the hotel. There is. There is? Yeah, it comes with a bar in the restaurant. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's called, like, a bistro, like a, a bay mm. bistro or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty lit. I'm so excited. <laughs> I literally look like I'm dead. Like, I feel so drained. I know. I wonder if this is what we're gonna feel like on like June 1st <laughs> in the morning. Like, uh -huh. because knowing me and her, we're not gonna sleep until like we get on the plane, maybe. Yeah. Or I'll sleep, like, we'll take like, we'll try to go to bed early. I don't think that's gonna happen. Yeah, no, we're gonna be too late. I might pass out. We're, I don't know. We're gonna, be, we're gonna be too late. We're like, yeah, we go <laughs> Like, I'm drinking the day before. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, if we can go with this one. The day before. Oh, word! Uh, she said, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, because I forgot I'd be 21 by the time I'm going to show. So, that's scary to think. Like, my birthday is in like five months. And I'm going out of fight. <laughs> like, it's, it's insane. Like,. Just being able to have this opportunity to do this, mm -hmm. like, and we seem like we're hyping it up too much because, like, oh, they're going on vacation. But like, have you ever paid for your own fucking vacation with your friend? Like, have you ever done that? Like, nobody that I know has ever done that. Yeah, like, my friends have gone on vacations, but like, their parents pay for it. You know what I mean? But like, when you pay for it yourself, it's like it's a different crap. experience because, like, you're like, wow, we're like actually working towards yeah. something mm -hmm. and like and the fact that we plan this within like the, tell, tell them how you're going to take you to so much travel oh my god <laughs> your own travel. yo like i shouldn't have even told my grandma that we were going on this trip but like my mom like she would have gotten mad at me if i didn't say anything yeah so like my grandma's like you need to go all inclusive blah 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 and then she's like oh we'll play for we'll pay for your plane ticket but you need to pay for the hotel first Guys, never do that because like why? If you like, can't get there, how are you gonna? How, like I'm gonna lose almost eight hundred dollars? No, thank you. No, thank you. Like I don't care if she's been on a million vacations. I know what I'm doing, and mm -hmm. that's with that. Like, and the funny thing is that like she wanted us to have like a travel agent, but like For we what? we are our own travel agent, agents. Like, what she doesn't understand is that we plan this within three nights. If that. Like, we just made moves. Like, if you didn't watch the first 10 minutes of the video, like... We are our own, like... <laughs> I don't need some old person telling me to go all-inclusive. Because I'm not... They're not paying for it. Nobody is paying for it but me. Mm -hmm. She was originally gonna pay for my plane ticket. I'm just gonna fucking do this shit myself. I don't care. Like... Doing this again. <laughs> <laughs> really, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Can you speak your first? Or don't you talk to me? We're going so <laughs> far away. We got. Oh, what's the police number in Turks and Caicos? 911. It's not America. Uh, well, how else? 911. We're going to call American police? Bruh. <laughs> it could be different. I don't know, Elizabeth. It is different. Because yeah, it's All not right. the United States. Well, you're gonna be a bitch about it. I'm not being he said honest. it is different. Okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's not a one. Turks and Caicos police number. Watch it be like eight one one. I feel like you're right, but like I don't want to say you're right. I said Tux and Caicos, but. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> he said, what's up? 
Hop off my dick. You don't like me. Sorry. <laughs> Guys, hand sanitizer case thing. Got a butterfly on it. Hell yeah. You already know the way. Oh my god. I'm sure that they'll have like the number like on like little desk with like I, all the numbers. I hope so. Because I, really I feel like so. that's something locals should know is like the police number. I mean, visitors. Travelers. Fuck it. I'm, I'm like sick. So I, I can't put it. This is a problem. Okay, this is also a problem. <laughs> the police station for Turks and Caicos has a whole entire fucking number. So are we supposed to remember the whole entire... Bitch, I'm gonna be too fucked up to remember that. Ten, no, ten digit number. Three, three, four. Seven, three, two. And then, like, hours. And then another three digit number. And then four digits. Yeah, but... We don't call a whole fucking ten digit number to get to the police. Oh, it's, it's loading. <laughs> it should give you like a like if you click on the website. It should give you like a what you call it. Um, like an emergency three digit number. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. Like we should have that. Whatever, we'll figure it out when we get there. <laughs> also, we, um, I started looking up also like taxis, obviously, because we're gonna need a taxi. Um, sort of. I wonder if they have Uber. It's probably really expensive in Texas, but you never know. Nah, okay. we never really go out. <laughs> like, like we just skipped the entire like yeah, going to a club. <laughs> we are going to another country. Yeah. And um, like, and I feel like it's more fun because I don't really want to go to clubs here because like, they, there's a potential possibility that we could see somebody that we know. Yeah. Why do you think I'm not going to Atlantic City for my birthday? Because and it's not I even don't... that. It's just like it's like it's like they're not fun. They all have like the Jersey Club remix and like, but if you go to like Turkey Hagos, are you throwing that ass back like for real? Me. <laughs> like, I'm wearing my this graduation dress. Up. Like my phone doesn't even ding when I have this shit on. I think it's because it's on me. Yeah. So, like. I have a, I'm wearing my graduation dress to like a dinner, like a restaurant in Turks and Caicos, like the really flowy. Leggings, shorts, I'm gonna bring like one pair of jeans just in case, I'm not really gonna wear jeans. I'm bringing a whole bunch of softy shorts, a whole bunch of bathing suits. I'm basically gonna pack really late. Bathing suits. Is, I don't like really wearing bathing suits. She doesn't even really, I've only really seen you swim once in my fucking life out of like the four years I've known you. Yeah. I, I don't know, like, I just get uncomfortable, like, swimming. Like, I know how to swim. Yeah, I know. I took swim lessons for, like, ten years. Well, you better get used to it, cause my pool's gonna probably, most likely, be open this so summer. Excited. If, like, Yo, you know. this is gonna be a great-ass summer, like. And my pool, everyone, like, thinks I don't have a pool. Like, I remember in elementary school, I was, like, on the bus, and I was telling these kids, like, I actually have a pool. And then they were, like, um, but these kids were, like, no, you don't got a pool. I looked it up on Google Maps and I looked at the satellite view of your house and you don't have a pool. And I'm like, first of all, it's creepy. And second of all, <laughs> um, and second of all, yeah, I do have a pool. Like, you may have not been looking at the right house, but like, this pool has been at my house since like before the Renaissance era. Like, it's been there. So, what are you talking about? <laughs> like, what? So, wasn't the Renaissance one like 1500? Yeah. Wow, I did pay attention in school. Um, but, all right, we're gonna shut, um, uh, shut down the video. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna shit. <laughs> and we are going to end the video here. Um, this is like the first video and we're just gonna tell you our journey through Brook, <laughs> Brook through Brookdale. <laughs> through booking this fucking trip. And this, <laughs> we, we are a mess. We are a mess. Hold up, hold up. I need help. I'm I'm think I'm getting sick, so that's why I'm like acting like all like fucking out of it right now. So hey guys, sorry for that um abrupt cut. Cut. Um we had to nothing paranormal, more of just um niggas be tripping and they just be going through shit out here and we had just went to Cheesecake Factory, as you can tell, we brought home well, I brought home leftovers, she brought home what, a strawberry cheesecake? Yeah. 
So we're here just filming the outro. <laughs> video right now we're just here to say thank you guys so much for watching this first episode of this very long series we don't know how long it's gonna be because we still have to book everything which might be a video i don't know because we're gonna be doing it like separately or we're gonna be together when we book it or separately separate but we're gonna be on the phone with each other so we're, i don't know how we're gonna record that i don't think we will but like we'll take pictures whatever and then um we'll we have to go shopping for stuff, obviously, when it gets closer, but, like, this series is going to be a lot. So We're just so excited to be, to be able to, like, have this opportunity and, like, able to have the money to do this because most kids aren't able yeah. to do this. Like, most kids can't even afford a cup of coffee. Yeah. So, for us to even, like, be able to, like, go is, like, fun, yo. Like, mm hmm Like, my family's happy, whatever. <laughs> So thank you guys so much for watching. Yes. And stay tuned for our upcoming video, which will be whatever. Oh wait, oh my God, my phone. I have the shout out. But um, shout out to Isaac Faints. He started playing your intro song. Um, he was one of the people who commented. Um, you guys can go check out from our previous video what he commented, but we wanted to shout you out and we wanted to say thank you so much for your support. So yeah. this is his um, YouTube account right here. I'll put so, it. I'll put. I'll put it with the comment as well. Um, so you know, super but, sweet. And we will be doing like your recommendation for like a video later in the next on. Few videos that we because we have some other ones lined up to do. Yes. But we'll definitely keep it in mind. Um, but we wanted to say thank you and so much for you. Thank you so much for your support. Yes. And yeah, so I think this is where we end the video here. Like we said, be sure to check out our part two to this video of our Turks and Caicos adventure. Yes. And we are super excited and blessed that we were able to be doing this. Yeah. And so excited. But yeah. Make right. sure that you guys follow our socials at the Butterfly Effect 14. They'll and be all down below. All down below, all that fun stuff. You guys are, <laughs> I'm so excited bro, I can't even talk. You guys already know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. And we will see you guys in the next Butterfly Effect video. All right, bye guys. Bye.